Okay, this is going to be a 2x2 two two tutorial for people that already know, um, obviously how to solve a 3x3 three three and have, know the PLLs and, like, the two OLLs, things like that. Just because, um, this is just, like, corners of a 3x3. Three three. So, if you know how to solve a um, Rubik's Cube, you'll figure out how to solve this, but this is going to be a little bit more advanced method than, um, the beginner's method, like the Dan Brown, uh, I don't know what it's called, but yeah. This is going to be with OLs and P I mean, yeah, it's PLs and OLs. So, to start off, you just get your first layer, and I'm just doing, I'm going to do green. So you can pretty much be color neutral with this, because the edges, you don't really have edges, so. Okay, then, this, see I got the first layer. This is like the, um, hold well, my three with you. Okay, so, this is the same as this on a 3x3. Three three. See? So, if you know this OLL, you just do this. So, on a 3x3, three three, it's this. And then, on a 2x2, two two, now you have the OLL. Oh. Here soon, you see. So here's too soon, and here's soon a two by two. And here's the one where there's a cross, two are facing that way, and one's facing this way, one's facing that way. See. Um, you just do the algorithm for that. And here's the algorithm where there's two facing that way and two, face, two facing that way. See, that way, that way. So, you just... See. Here's the one where it's a box on top, one, and then there's two facing this way. See? Same thing. Yes. And here's the one where it's the same thing, but one's facing this way, one's facing that way instead of them facing this way. So. Another OLL for 2x2 um, two two is anti soon and soon. So this is anti soon. So, see, same thing. Um, so you could. That's my anti soon um, algorithm. There's people also do it from back here. But, okay. This is PLL skip. But, the two algorithms that I use, I mean, you can use a bunch of different um, PLLs, but this, I, if it has just two over here, I think uh, T permutation, so it, it just switches these, but you could also do, like, the one that switches these two and the, the two edges, or you can do, um, what can you do? You can do a bunch of different ones, but I just do T permutation for this, so. Okay, and the, the other, the other algorithm I use is the Y permutation. So, it switches these two and these two on the 3 3 so it looks like this. But, but on the 2, but on the 2 by 2 it's. See, it's with these, this, this one, and this one I have to switch, see. So, you just put it, just like, imagine there's two edges that are switching here, and you just do Y permutation. See. 
You could also do, um, uh, this one, where this one switches this one, these, these two. Um, it's, it looks like the same thing on the 2x2, two two. you could also do that if you wanted.